Hello friends, this video on light, shadows and reflection part 9 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So now that we have discussed a lot of stuffs about light, we talked about shadows, we talked about images, we talked about reflection of light. So let us talk about something very interesting. We all know what is camera. We often use it to click pictures. Now it seems to be something very complicated from inside. but we can also make a very simple camera that is a pinhole camera and it is so simple that you can even make it yourself and do you know what is a pinhole camera the name itself tells us pinhole so it is a camera with one single hole with one single very tiny aperture and how it works so let's say this is the object and this is the pinhole camera so it is like a box which is completely dark inside except one hole so there is just one single tiny hole and inside the box it is completely dark so when you look through this hole light rays from an object will enter through this hole and it will create an image but the image would be inverted that inverted image will be created on the opposite face of the box so it is like this box as you can see here this is the tree and the light enters through this small pin hole and then an inverted image is created on the opposite face of the box so this is how a pin hole camera works so it, if you want to construct a pin hole camera again it is very simple all we need is we need to ensure that there is a box inside with completely black interior with a tiny hole so in this camera, in pinhole camera, there is no lens involved. So it is very simple as light from the object passes through the tiny hole and it projects an inverted image on the opposite side of the box. So let us see how can we make a pinhole camera. So for this, all you need is you need a box like this uh, in the shape of a cuboid, maybe this kind of a box. So you take this box, you keep one side open. So this side of the box is open. Okay, so one side is open, this side is closed and here you make a tiny hole. So you have a hole here. So this acts as the pinhole. So that's how you arrange this box. Now this box has to be slightly bigger in size. Now you take another box which is slightly smaller than this box. And the difference in sizes should be such that the smaller box should exactly fit inside the bigger box and you should be able to move the smaller box inside the bigger box. So this box also you keep it open. Now for this box what you do is you cut in the shape of a rectangle here as you see. So this portion is cut and then this portion is covered with a photographic film or a transparent film. So you just paste a photographic film or a transparent film here, right? And now what you have to do, you put this smaller box inside the bigger box. Make sure that the smaller box fits exactly within the bigger box. And now you can move the smaller box. You can adjust the smaller box to see the image. And where will you see the image? You'll be able to see the image on this film which you have attached here. Because remember the concept of pinhole camera, light from any object will enter through this hole and it will project an inverted image on the other face. And the other face for this hole would be this face. So here it will form that image on this tiny screen. So on this screen you will be able to see an inverted image. So now as you keep moving the smaller box, as you keep uh, uh, bring it near to your eyes or take it away from your eyes you will be able to see the size of the image also is changing so that's how you can get a feel of a pinhole camera and it is very simple to create it in fact you can create it at your home itself you do not need a lot of stuffs you just need two boxes of these kinds which you can make using cardboards and just make a tiny hole in one and uh, cut a square and put a thin film on the other one. And with that, you can actually visualize or experience a pinhole camera. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.